Hello and welcome to NBC News. You are watching English Bulletin with me, Ratnakar. The news in detail. The Union Ministry of Health and Family Welfare is conducting various experiments to develop a vaccine in order to control the COVID-19 pandemic. The Nagpur Municipal Corporation is in the process of compiling a detailed database of the complete information regarding health workers, doctors and staff. Guidelines have been issued by the Central and State Health Department in this regard. However, many private hospitals doctors have not provided the details of health workers working for them in the prescribed format. As per the order of the Government Municipal Commissioner Radhakrishnan B has appealed to all the hospitals and dispensers in the city to submit information before Diwali. In this regard, Additional Commissioner Ram Joshi said that the information of government and private hospitals in Nagpur is to be compiled and submitted to the central and state government. Diwali is just a few days away. Accumulation of a crowd usually takes place in many parts of the city. This is a festival of joy. While celebrating this joy, it is important to be careful that so it does not turn into a time of sorrow. Even though the cases of COVID-19 positive cases in the city are low at present, everyone needs to be vigilant. While celebrating Diwali, it is mandatory for everyone to follow all the rules regarding COVID-19, said Municipal Commissioner Radha Krishnan P. Wake of the coronavirus pandemic, according to the order, everyone must follow the rules. Apart from this, Commissioner Radha Krishnan B. also appealed not to use firecrackers on Diwari. According to the order issued by Radha Krishnan B., no firecrackers will be allowed in Sirens Zone. The Nagpur Division of the Graduate Constituency is in the stronghold of the BJP. Many veteran leaders, including Union Minister Nitin Gadkari, have maintained the stronghold now. The party has shouldered the responsibility. It is my responsibility to retain the fort to solve all the problems of graduates and teachers, said Bhati Janda Party's Nagpur Graduate Constituency candidate Mayor Sandeep Joshi. He said that the, from an ordinary activist of BJP UA Morcha to the mayor of Nagpur City, he has been receiving guidance of veteran leaders. Union Minister Nitin Gharki and leader of the opposition and former CM Devendra Fernandes are the same veteran who have been maintained by the party today to lead the graduates. So far, BJP has always tried to handle every responsibilities given to it. In the same way, BJP will retain its stronghold in the polls. Nagpur Municipal Corporation's News Detection Squad personnel on Tuesday took action against 236 irresponsible citizens and fine of Rs. 1,18,000 has been recorded from them. In the last few days, search team have taken action against 18,604 citizens and recorded a total fine of Rs. 76,61,000 from them. Corona positive cases and casualties are receding, yet social distancing being not observed at many places in as a case of concern. On Tuesday, 43 under Lakshmi Nagar Zone, 54 under Dharampet Zone, 16 under Hanuman Nagar Zone, 15 under Dandori Zone, 7 under Nehru Nagar Zone, 16 under Gandhi Bagh Zone, 16 under Satranjipura Zone, 9 under Lakhragan Zone, and 23 under Ashinagar Zone, and 1 person at the NMC headquarter were fined. Under the guidance, under the guidance of search team chief Virsen Tame, so far Rs. 65 lakh 67,000 has been recorded from 13,134 responsible citizens. Two brothers were largely duped investors to the tune of over Rs 35 crores on the pretext of high return in digital advertising investment will now face the heat from economic offense wing. Cops from Sitabadi police station who had booked these two fraudsters on Monday handed over investigation of Rs 35 crores scam to the economic offense wing. The two con siblings, Sushil Ramesh Kole, Pankaj Ramesh Kole, both resident of Neem Devi Karna, have been accused of defrauding over 3,500 investors from Maharashtra, Chhattisgarh, and MP by luring them of a huge profit after investing in digital advertising. It may be recalled that acting on a complaint lodged by Narendra Singh Babu Singh Thakur, a resident of Betul Ganj, MP Sitabadi Police had registered a case against the two brothers Sushil Kole, Pankaj, Ramesh Kole, and their accomplice Bharat Shahu. Well, that's all from this bulletin. For more news updates in and around the city, stay tuned with NBC News. Till then, Ratnaka says goodbye. Please take very good care of yourself and family.